is good everybody welcome back to another my damn toys video today ladies and gentlemen we are diving back into uh, first of all happy fourth of july to everyone i hope you guys are enjoying a nice day with family or time off or whatever it is you know whatever you want to do man just light a firework on your trash corbin figure is all i ask so today guys again we are literally diving into more news it's more news it's more news it's more news just overflowing with news man i wish i was making this stuff up not really but seriously though more WWE, not even WWE again. It's We're back to AEW, so every other day I feel like it flip-flops between WWE action figures and AEW action figures. Today we're on the AEW Unrivaled Collection side, guys, and it is from our man Prince of Figures. A huge shout-out to him, man. I didn't think I was going to upload today, but he hit me with some news, man, and I had to put it up to you guys and let you guys know about it, see what your thoughts were and all of that. So let's go ahead and dive in. So our news today, ladies and gentlemen, is actually going to be about the brand-new upcoming AEW Unrivaled Amazon Experience exclusive Chris Jericho figure. You guys know that we saw this figure a little while back at AEW Double or Nothing Fan Fest. You guys remember it was on display. It had Series 6 around it. You know, it was kind of, you know, we were kind of speculating about what it would be entirely. And we kind of speculated that it would kind of be like a cross between the AEW Series 6 Unrival Collection Jericho and the AEW Unrival Collection 1 Chris Jericho. Because, you know, the, the tights are kind of plain. They don't have the yellow pattern on them like the Series 6 figure. You guys know that we also have that four pack that we discussed that was pretty much a re release of the six figure or the Series 6 figure. So we got a lot of Chris Jericho's flying around today, guys. But today we're going to dive into that Chris Jericho Amazon exclusive because we have a little bit more news about it. And apparently, now this is the word on the street, apparently this is going to be kind of like a, a gear pack or something like that where it's going to be an AEW Unrivaled Collection Chris Jericho figure. And not only are we going to be getting the pink suit, guys, but apparently we're going to be getting a white suit as well. So I think we're going to be getting not a suit, but you guys know what I mean. We're going to get a white jacket to go with our pink jacket. Now you guys know, uh, I think Chris Jericho wore the white jacket on the night or the at the time that him and Orange Cassidy were feuding. I think he ended up getting like orange juice all over his jacket and it like stained the, the hell out of the jacket or whatever that was. But the uh, Chris Jericho figure, the Amazon exclusive is going to be a gear pack one and it's going to come with two different jackets and apparently the packaging I, I think we're working on getting an image of the figure i don't know exactly but i think we're supposed to be getting an image of the figure and it will be similar to the packaging that we got with our two packs that we saw just the other day you know the darby and the john moxley that we took a look at, and then the uh, the SCU, the Frankie Kazarian, and the Scorpio Sky re-releases that we also talked about. Now, I don't know if those are going to be Amazon exclusive as well, but I do know that the packaging for the Jericho will be very similar to that, in which it will have, like, Jericho on one side, the accessories that he's going to be getting in the middle, and then he has the two jackets. So you'll get two different expressions there, or two different jackets that you can wear, and it's really cool to think that we're going to be getting two different jackets, because you could put, you know, one, the white jacket on a different figure or you can have two different suits there or suit jackets for other figures and stuff like that i hope that the jackets fit the figures well i know that we took a look at the jericho and it kind of fit I, I feel like it fits the jericho figure pretty well but that one is kind of you know stuffy so hopefully you know those jackets will fit onto other aew and rival collection figures other wwe action figures and stuff like that really snug and those will look nice as well because i mean how good is a jacket like yeah it's really sick to have it for your chris jericho but how sick would it be to have it for other figures as well and be able to use it and put it on other guys? The white jacket, the pink jacket, MDT figure, Seth Drippin, Rollins, all of those different things. So not only in this pack are we going to be getting the two different jacket accessories, guys, but we're also going to be getting other things as well. So as you guys saw on display at AEW Double or Nothing Fan Fest, we also had the yellow sunglasses, but I think he's also going to come with two interchangeable hands, which will be his gloved hands. So it's very similar to what his Series 1 figure that came with the two gloved hands accessories for entrances and, you know, uh, promos and things of that nature. You also have an AEW microphone, and then you also have a scarf accessory, and I think the scarf is going to be very similar to a Series 6 figure, and if it's not the same one, it is a little bit differently. I, I don't have them right here side by side, so I don't know the exact ones, but a huge shout-out to Prince Unmatched on Instagram 
for the information on this uh, Amazon exclusive Chris Jericho and what exactly we're going to be getting a two in one figure sort of deal or a gear pack or whatever it is man it's really crazy because Jazz wears with Jeremy at the helm man they have so many cool ideas I know that it kind of has been like kind of slow getting the start but I think once we start rolling it's going to be kind of like WWE action figures where it's just going to be thing after thing after thing which is kind of you know uh, I mean I guess it can be a bad thing but it's also really exciting to be a collector because you're always going to have new things on the shelves you're not always going to have new things coming out and it's going to make things really refreshing and really nice and stuff I feel like when I was a kid there was always something new but I don't know if it's because you know I didn't have my finger on it the whole time but I feel I feel like every time I went to Walmart, there was new stuff on the shelves. So that was always exciting for me as a kid. And I don't know if it's still the same for you guys or what you guys think about that. But I feel like, you know, nowadays it's the same things over and over and over again. But I think once we get this product out there, I think that, you know, Jazz Wears and everybody is going to be having AEW stuff come out a lot. And there'll be plenty of stuff to go around. And I think also, I think there's word that Toys R Us is trying to make a comeback as well. So that could even add to the fire there where we could end up having, you know, a toy. If Toys R Us came back, then even if it was just specific locations they could also have more shelf space so that could call for more play sets that could call for more things coming out but AEW is selling like hotcakes every I mean like they don't stay on shelves very long like most people they can't even find them in stores and then when they do find them in stores they're gone like the next time like I think the other day when I found series four me and John you know we we grabbed what we wanted and then the next time like I went back the next day just to check and everything else was gone so the things go man they absolutely go and I know that you know the again the deeper we get into it the more accessible and everything like that, we will be able to get more things, more play sets, more gear packs, more just really cool stuff for your, you know, our action figure collections and stuff like that. Gear packs, weapon packs, all of these really cool things that people really want to add to their collections and stuff. So the Amazon exclusive Chris Jericho apparently is going to be two in one, two different jackets. You get the white jacket and the pink jacket. And I think that's all the news that I have for you guys today, but I had to put it up to you guys because I wanted to know what, exactly what you thought. And I thought I was going to have an appointment or a surgery. However, it looks like that will be pushed back to either tomorrow or the next day. And so I had this news, so I wanted to go ahead and get it out to you guys, see what you guys thought about it and all of that stuff. But before we get out of here, guys, let's get into a random shout out. And this shout out is going to go to Ethan Foster, who says, I'm I'm literally watching this in a car dealership and that got 11 likes for some reason but I thought that was really funny just uh I, you know you're watching MDT no matter where you are so that's pretty cool so I guess you can comment down below where you're watching this video right now so I appreciate that huge shout out to Ethan for that that was awesome but uh, I hope everything worked out I hate car dealerships man I like the process of buying a car or just you know anything to do with a car is just so long and just so depressing man you're sitting you rot there all day if you get there at literally 7 a.m. when they open you will literally rot there until 7 p.m. that's just the way it is you might as well pack a sack lunch and uh, go ahead and book your stay because you're there forever, Brad. And that's where car dealerships cross the line. You cross the line, I've been beaten, broken.